Hi Pisces, I'm Jennifer Angel. This is my snapshot report for you for the week of April the 11th. Now there's a lot going on in this chart. It's very exciting this week because there's a lot of favorable aspects and a lot of them are coming off the um, planet Mercury, which is in your communication area and area of creativity, uh, working with these others on an intellectual and creative level. Uh, there is a very nice aspect between Neptune your ruler in your sign and Mercury so um, and an inspired moment can really just lift you out of one place and put you in another place so I would have my like pen and paste paper handy you don't want to miss any amazing in inspired uh, thoughts this week because as I said they can lead to something sort of fabulous now there is an aspect between Mercury and Pluto Pluto sits in your area of friendship and social and <clears throat> this allows you to really speak your truth and to say how you feel to someone rather than how you think don't sugarcoat it so you know speak just right from the heart um, and particularly around friends and, and people that you're socializing with now there's a lot of activity in your second house which is all to do with your money material support Venus is in here as well as the Sun and Uranus now with Venus in the second house when we look at love uh, it can set up a little bit of a possessiveness as well so you want to be careful about being uh, you know jealous or overly possessive unless of course there's a reason uh, for it a good reason for it then of course you want to deal with it um, <clears throat> excuse me but the Venus and uh, let's not forget that Venus rules love and money and we have a favorable trine aspect between Venus and Mars this week this is fabulous particularly for you Pisces because it's not only great for love but it's it's fabulous for business because Mars sits there in your career zone your solar 10th house all about your career advancement and business so and Venus in the second house of money so you put these two together you can just get together with people the right people at the right time to do the perfect deal or to get something together that's going to be good for you financially if not now then for the future this is a great week to really get things into place as well because Mars will go retrograde at the end of this week Mercury retrograde at the end of this month and by the end of this month we're going to have five planets retrograde so going into May and June as well things are going to slow down a little bit which is a great time to do research uh, think about what changes you want to make fine-tuned things so um, it can be a little bit frustrating because you want to keep you want to go ahead and things you know are not falling into place so this week and over this next couple of weeks is a great time to put things into action have the discussion make the decisions and get things in a place then you can start fine-tuning in the retrograde period now Jupiter right opposite you there is a favorable aspect with um, Mercury and Jupiter as well so once again this is that right opposite you and there's my puppy dog right opposite you is that area where you can have those discussions with people that you're close to okay so great week for you Pisces great week for business money love and the one thing that's yeah, my puppy dog I'll bring him out to say hello the one thing that you need to do here he is here <laughs> is is speak from your heart okay and that's really the message for this week all right thanks so much for watching persevering with my puppy dog barking love and luck to you i hope you have a great week bye for now